Werner Heisenberg was born on 5th December 1901 at Würzburg. He was the son of Dr. August Heisenberg. His father later became professor of the Middle and Modern Greek languages in the University of Munich. It was probably due to his influence that Heisenberg remarked when the Japanese physicist Yukawa discovered the particle now known as Mason and the term Mesotron was proposed for it that the Greek word Mesos has no TR in it with the result that the name Mesotron was changed to Mison. Heisenberg went to the Maximilian school at Munich until 1920 when he went to University of Munich to study physics under Sommerfeld. During the winter of 1922 to 1923, he went to Göttingen to study physics under Max Born, Frank and Hilbert. In 1923, he took his PhD at the University of Munich and then became assistant to Max Born at University of Göttingen. And in 1924, he gained the Wiener Legendi at the university. From 1924 until 1925, he worked with a Rockefeller grant with Niels Bohr at the University of Copenhagen, returning for the summer of 1925 to Göttingen. In 1926, he was appointed lecturer in theoretical physics at the University of Copenhagen under Niels Bohr in 1927. And when he was only 26, he was appointed professor of theoretical physics at the University of Leipzig. In 1929, he went on to lecture tour to the United States, Japan and India. In 1941, he was appointed professor of physics at the University of Berlin and director of Kaiser Wilhelm Institute of Physics there. At the end of Second World War, he and other German physicists were taken prisoner by American troops and sent to England. But in 1946, he returned to Germany and reorganized with his colleagues the Institute of Physics at Göttingen. This institute was in 1948 renamed the Max Planck Institute of Physics. In 1948, Heisenberg stayed for some months in Cambridge, England to give lectures and in 1950 and 1954, he was invited to lecture in the United States. In the winter of 1955 to 1956, he gave the Gifford Lectures at the University of St. Andrews, Scotland, these lectures being subsequently published as a book. During 1955, Heisenberg was occupied with preparations for the removal of the Max Planck Institute for Physics to Munich. Still director of this institute, he went with it to Munich and in 1958, he was appointed professor of physics in the University of Munich. Heisenberg's name will always be associated with his theory of quantum mechanism, published in 1925 when he was only 23 years old. For this theory and applications of it, which resulted especially in the discovery of allotropic forms of hydrogen, Heisenberg was awarded the Nobel Prize for Physics in 1932. His new theory was based only on what can be observed, that is to say, on the radiation emitted by the atom. Later, Heisenberg stated his famous principle of uncertainty, which lays it down that the determination of the position and momentum of a mobile particle necessarily contains errors the product of which cannot be less than the quantum constant h and that although these errors are negligible on the human scale they cannot be ignored in studies of the atom from 1957 onwards heisenberg was interested in work on problems of plasma physics and thermonuclear processes and also much work in close collaboration with the international institute of atomic physics at geneva he was for several years chairman of the scientific policy committee of this institute and subsequently remained a member of this committee. When he became in 1953 the president of the Alexander von Humboldt Foundation, 
He did much to further the policy of this foundation, which was to invite scientists from the other countries to Germany and to help them to work there. Since 1953, President of the Alexander von Humboldt Foundation, he did much to further the policy of this foundation, which was to invite scientists from the other countries to Germany and help them to work there. Since 1953, his own theoretical work was concentrated on the unified field theory of elementary particles, which seems to him to be the key to an understanding of the physics of elementary particles. Apart from many medals and prizes, Heisenberg received an honorary doctorate of the University of Brussels. He is also recipient of the Order of Merit of Bavaria and the Grand Cross of Federal Services with Star Germany. He is a Fellow of Royal Society of London and a Knight of the Order of Merit Peace Class. He is a member of the Academies of Sciences of Göttingen, Bavaria, Saxony, Persia, Sweden, Romania, Norway, Spain, the Netherlands, Rome, the German, etc. During 1949 to 1951, he was the president of German Research Council. One of his hobbies is classical music. He is a distinguished pianist. Thank you for watching Edupedia World. Please subscribe to watch more videos.